Hey guys, welcome to part 4. Now that all the basic painting has been done, the body received its color and clear, I can move on to detail painting the rest of the parts and maybe start some assembling. The chassis is painted in the same color as the body. It should have been some gold color, but I don't really go for the originality, I just like doing it this way. Some parts needed to be painted black, so I did that with some Vallejo black, applying it with a brush. heat shielding and some brackets so I did that as well also Vallejo but then some silver instead of black was of course not the only part in need of some detail painting so off we go to the firewall I believe this is the power steering housing that needed some silver as well and some other parts got some silver too there were some decals supplied by the kit but I decided to do it with a brush give it a realistic look and make it a lot easier than to have to apply a decal exactly on there. some silver uh, on it and I decided to continue that theme all around the interior starting off with the center console. So moving on to the window surrounds, these needed to be black, so I marked off the edge with a pencil so that when I lay the tape over it, I can see where I need to cut. Now I did a detailed video on this a while ago, so click on the link below and it will open in a new window without interrupting this video.
unnecessary masking, I started painting. I did this with some Vallejo flat black, like the one I used earlier on. I gave it two thinner coats to make it cover and not have it one really thick coat. That's all done, I can move on to the body again. Starting off with doing some panel lines, I also did a video on this a while ago. So click on the link below and it will open in a new window. did a video on that as well, click on the link to go to that video. The tail lights are very nicely detailed and cast, but it also comes with some decals to make it look even nicer and to not have to paint them on the outside. So I applied those and I painted the outside and the back side in some clear red from Tamiya. I gave it two coats and left it at that. to some assembly, starting it off with the engine. Everything I am gluing on here is done with cheap super glue.
some bolts with some Tamiya paint and a toothpick. Check out my Facebook for status updates and photos, questions or suggestions, post a comment or shoot me an email. And as always, thanks for watching, hope to see you guys next time.